Pray for Pensacola, a city in the Gulf Coast of Florida. We have seen many positive changes take place in Pensacola, Florida in the past seven years. Abortion clinics have closed. The downtown has been completely updated and is filled with life. Poverty has been dropped and many jobs have come to the city. It's a great city, a light in the nation of America. Why? Because we prayed to pray for Pensacola. Check it out. Be sure to subscribe and press alert to get new notifications of new success secrets made available on VFN TV. We're talking about prayer for Pensacola. It was started by Joe Miller, who had a passion to be able to see, you know, transformation in a city. He came from Chicago, I believe, hmm. went to the Gulf Coast, if I remember that. And uh, yeah, and, wanted, and began to lead Pensacola, the city that he was in, that was going through you know, struggles and different things that are going on during that time. I want you to read about that at yeah. a moment. Uh, into a time of 40 days, 40 days of prayer and fasting. It's a beautiful thing. It has, and, and, and it has, uh, since that began, and other people have been praying as well. It's not yeah. the only prayer that's going on, sure. but, but the city had begun to transform. It's gone through some major shiftings. No doubt, since and, 2008, uh, I believe, is when they started. It's, it's, so I want to tell you this real quick. Like you can see it on your screen right here. On January the 6th, starting at 9, 9 a.m. in 2019, a 40-day uh, time of prayer and fasting is coming up, and you're looking at right here. That's a beautiful downtown Pensacola. You're looking at the, the Wahoo Stadium. The Wahoo Stadium right there, and Apollo Fox. You're looking at the Bay Bridge in the background right there. Maritime Park. You're looking at Pat's penthouse back in is the corner. Is that what that is? Okay. <laughs> All right. We're so excited about our new book, I Will Fight Strategies for Your Success. You gotta have a strategy and you gotta fight. It's not about a physical fight, but you gotta fight. And guess what? If you fight, you win. You'll be successful. This book is about transforming your thoughts, about what your beliefs, the decisions that you're making about speaking, what you say is so powerful, and what you do, what you're saying, your actions you take. And quitting, don't quit. Listen, success and failure quite often is just five more minutes. And finally, think about this. So many people talk about you should do this, and you should do this, and you should do this. And look what they're doing, they're not doing nothing. You can't let people tell you, you should do this. You should. As a matter of fact, they can't be putting their should on you. This is so important. Listen, we wanna bless you with your free copy of I Will Fight Strategies for Your Success. You can get it at vfnkb.com. That's vfnkb.com. Get your free copy today. Okay. Actually, if you, that's what you want to get me for Christmas. Uh, is that so what I can really, get you? Yeah, I would like to have it right Thank there. Thank you. I'm going to add that to the list. Right down there, as All a matter right. of fact. But Excellent. Read up a little bit what sure. this is about. Sure. This is on their website um, about the event. In 2008, a small group of about 100 people came together and made a decision to fast and pray for 40 days for our city. That is how we started. Uh, we were a group from many different churches and we connected by the internet. Back then, Pensacola was a small town with a large amount of problems and we had two abortion clinics. We didn't have a full-time mayor yet and the downtown was empty, old, and dead on the weekends. I remember that. Yes. <laughs> Poverty was a continual issue. We decided to tackle a different problem every 40 days. We did this again in 2009, in 2010, and continued it until 2015. Because I had a calendar set up and every single yeah. day would be a different focus in that 40 days sure. as well as the whole thing together. Yeah. It's beautiful. What we saw each year was that God slowly changed our city. We took off a few years but are jumping back in for 2019. We feel God is leading us again. And yes, we're excited about what the Lord is going to do in our area this year. Because of all the prayers, uh, we recognize God's momentum in Pensacola, Escambia County, and Santa Rosa County. We have seen Pensacola area change dramatically since 2008 when we first started to pray and fast for our area. Here are just a few victories. One, there were two abortion clinics in 2008, and currently they are both closed because of much prayer and fasting. Praise Jesus God. loves life, and after all, he is the way, the truth, and the life. Mm -hmm. Two, we used, uh, we used to be considered a small, poor city, but now we have companies from all over, such as Navy Federal, and it's 17,000 jobs, just to name a few. <laughs> Downtown is changing. We've had so many things that have happened in this city, I can't even list them all. Listen, if you want to sign up to be a part of it, no matter where you are in the world, you can sign up. Is it prayerforpensacola.com? You can see it on your screen or go to vfnkb.com to find out some more details on that. You can pray and fast anywhere. As a matter of fact, I think about, you know, Baker, Louisiana, how they're yeah. praying for their city, Pensacola, Mobile, and others around the world are praying for, for your city. We just pray God will bless you 
and uh, participate in this. And we want to pray for you right now. Father God, I just thank you, Lord, for, for uh, Joe Miller, Lord God. I pray a blessing over that prayer for Pensacola and, and, and Pensacola, Father God. And I just thank you, Lord, that even we're going to participate for yes. seven days of that, Father God. And I pray for each and every one to be encouraged and inspired, Lord, that you would hear the cries of our heart, Father God, and shift the Gulf Coast into the glory zone happenings that you've been showing me even since the beginning of this journey. Father God, we pray it even so. And dear God, we ask you, Lord, end abortion, send revival, send a third great awakening, we pray in Jesus' name. God bless. Be sure to subscribe and press alert to get new notifications of new success secrets made available on VFN TV. You know, a lot of people want to abide with the Lord, but they just don't have a plan to do it. You can request that plan today at iabide.org. I'm your host, Greg Lancaster, and we're so glad that you've joined us. Don't forget you can join us 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Download our app and sign up for our newsletter, The Torch, at vfnkb.com. I've enjoyed our time together. God bless. Thank you.